get to watch. So the guy wearing the shirt on the stream here is going to be Michael versus Crudge. Uh, Crudge kind of in the mid-level of play. He's kind of gotten a couple high places in tournaments in the local scene. Uh, not a lot of entrance at those tournaments, but hey, man, when you get top three at a local, and even though the sharks are in the water, like you understand, yeah. like, hey, man, at least I got second to, like, easy. Zenyu or yeah. somebody else, right? Yeah. But I'll tell you about Mike Go and SoCalSmash.net. The shirt that he's wearing here mm -hmm. is a very lovely website here made by this player, Maiko. Um, it basically utilizes all the information from Smash.gg, compiles it into one lovely website for all the locals in SoCal, and it makes any local in SoCal easy to find. It gives you the latest tournament standings, and it gives you the latest local standings, yeah. and the latest hottest events. If you're coming to SoCal, or if you're interested in being in SoCal, and for any top player probably watching this, SoCalSmash.net is probably the best website to keep in touch with SoCal and all the players. And sometimes I tell people, for those of you guys new to SoCal, check out the website, honestly. It's really yeah, good. Check and it out right now. Yeah, and you can add it to the home screen from your onto your phone if you're having an iPhone or an Android, and it's already optimized. You don't even need to have, you know, a Google Play account or, you know, an iOS account. You can just have it right off the bat here. Yeah, and a Smash player did that. Yeah, I'm telling you, man. It's, it's a lovely website, but we'll see what else Michael can create with this Yoshi, because he's not making websites. He's out here <laughs> making plays against Crudges Terry. That was a good segue. <laughs> <laughs> I tried, man. I tried. <laughs> I respect it. Yeah. Um, Michael, he he has so many tricks up his sleeves. I'm I'm curious to see what he how his bag of tricks goes up against this new character. I haven't really seen too many Yoshi's interact with Terry. Yeah, uh, you know, still being fresh. It's not. It's barely gonna be a week. This character's been out. Right, and one thing that Yoshi does have a little bit over Terry is like lasting hitboxes, but Terry also is able to have like great combos that bring you up into percents, which will allow you to get into it. But Yoshi also has great combos. I do like the fact that Michael goes for that up throw, kind of trying to get Crutch up on a platform to see if you can get him with up air. Nice yep. opportunity, there it goes with up tilt. I feel like that was like 10% too much at the beginning of that combo. Mm -hmm. That would have ended up in a stock. Okay, like he's got to watch out when Go is active. Terry gets access to just two very powerful moves. Power Geyser and Buster Wolf. And if he's not careful, mm, he'll get killed just like so. That's Buster Wolf, right? Especially, yeah, especially from the ledge, too. The, you have to, so the input, you have to make sure you have the inputs properly. If not, you can't go for the special bu uh, button, which is the B button. Yeah. Inputs aren't too hard. Uh, I think Locus on his Twitter kind of put out a little, little sheet for everybody to learn the inputs. Oh. Oh, nice guy. Nice, Michael has this one in the hands, man. He's got Terry at 154. If he can definitely take him out before he gets any percent on him. Oh. Nice mix up. What a definitely big change up against Crudge. The Yoshi Classic. Ooh, up air, up to. Oh, he's got him. Wow. Yep, he's got him there on the down air. And Michael's wow. going to take that one off of Terry's hands. And Michael has to, like, uh, fast fall that so that the last hit doesn't mm -hmm. hit. Wow. That's cool. Kind of like a drag down dare, pretty yeah. much. That was very daring. Nice. So the thing sometimes that we do see Terry Mains go for Power Wave is it allows the to, for it to cover low and then read your opponent's jump in. Yeah. Unfortunately, Crutch uh, didn't get the frame where he's able to actually move away from Power Wave and try to punish his opponent for going for air. So this allowed Michael to go for a back air. Oh, that's going to be big here. Can you get him on the edge Ooh. guard? I like it. Goes for an empty hop here. He tries to play a little bit of respect. So he knows what happened with Buster Wolf. He knows all of Terry's kind of a little bit of his recoveries now. Oh, I like it. He tried to go for the forward air because <laughs> he knows he's going to be coming back for that. Yeah, it just kind of seems like Michael's waiting for his little moment to get his stock. But. Mm hmm. He's, he's been pretty good off the ledge, too, because sometimes we do see him go for forward air. I kind of want to see him go for nair, but usually it's really good to go for icy Yoshi's go for nair when it's really below towards the stage. You got to watch out for Yoshi's tail, though. It does. It is very disjointed. Oh, yeah. I think he's unforgiving. Uh, positive trade there. And Michael will take game one, two stocks over Crudge at 111%. Man, he wipes the sweat off his pants like a champion. Tuh. Doesn't even need a headband. He doesn't, dude. So yeah, uh, I think yeah, Locus definitely check out. I think Locus's Twitter oh, is going to be that one? yeah, it's going to be uh, Locus SK, and I don't know if he has it on his pin tweet, but he has like a little spreadsheet of like all of Terry's like inputs for you guys wondering. Um, definitely check it out. Well, uh, so Michael game one in his hands. He kind of got crutch a little bit on 
the problem that sometimes Terry tends to suffer is recovering on the stage. Yeah. Right? Even though he does have rising tackle, like that move doesn't completely give you invulnerability when you're coming back on the ledge here. So I'm like kind of a really good understanding of like, okay, Terry's recovery is kind of linear. He is going to go for that side B. Uh, the other side B because Terry has two different yeah. side Bs, which yeah. is going to be crack shoot. That's cool. Mm -hmm. um, so is Ike his main? I actually have never seen Crudge um, play myself. So I can definitely tell you that if it is his main, I hope it is because <laughs> he's. <laughs> well, it better he, be. <laughs> yeah, he has to pull him out like he is his main, especially yeah. if he's making a switch to him. I'm assuming it is. But Ike also has kind of like the same problems that Terry can have is like recovering on the stage. But we also kind of saw how like Krom was on the stage too as well. And the last game between Doughboy. Yeah, I feel like just uh, Koji is playing a little too close to Maiko, not giving him enough room to like uh, let that sword swing and just kind of keep. Mm -hmm. Like, I kind of bait him into, into and, falling into the sword. Yeah, and we're not seeing Crutch going for aerials. Like, sometimes we'll see um, Ike go for, like, a landing near, right? And if they space it safely on the shield, right, they can definitely go for a grab or a punish afterwards. Yeah. You just have to make sure you get the spacing right, because if you don't, you will eat a punish. There is Ooh, a jab reset, but no confirm. Michael wow. shakes his head on that one. He said, I thought I had it. I yeah. swear to you, man, that, that stock was mine. That second hit just kind of, like, knocked him to his feet, though. Yeah. I hate to see that happen. Perry, Crudge looking for a little bit of a whip punish. Michael gets in with an air. Oh, Could well. confirm. I thought he almost had the forward air, but just a little bit under Crudge, Ooh. and Crudge speaks him out there with a the back air. Yeah, and that was just stock one. Oh. That's not a bad position for Crudge. Yeah, and not even a bad position to Mike. for Michael. He almost, not enough for the shield break there, wow. but the parry on the last hit there, that was pretty crucial for Crudge. So, that was a good mix-up. Yeah. I did not see that coming. Crunch kind of keeping the neutral here. He doesn't want to overcome it here. I took another space in there. It's confirming into other options. Michael on the back foot, 84%. He can't even hit 162 off of Ike yet. I do like it, though. We've seen Michael a little bit patient as well. He doesn't want to overshoot it. Yeah. It's always good to just reset back to neutral when you feel like things aren't going uh, the way you want in the match. Up tilt. No up air. Uh -huh. Oh, wow. tough trade. He gets the stock, but unfortunately, man, he doesn't even get to keep his. Wow. Nice, good air to shield. One of the things that's really hard, I mean, Yoshi's egg is the hardest egg I've ever seen in history. Right? <laughs> like, real talk, it's it's not really easy to break Yoshi's shield. I eat eggs for breakfast. Those yeah. look like they hurt. And then Yoshi's egg, man, his shield is really, really hard. It's, it's a tough egg to crack, for sure. Yeah. Oh, that could take so much damage. I don't think I've ever really seen a Yoshi in this game get a shield break. Yeah, shield it's, it's 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 tough. Unless it's like a Lucina. Down throw, it goes for the upper, yup. And he's got the platform for the extension that's seventy three percent on Tomiko with Crutch having two stocks. I told you, man, he's gotta yeah. play this eye like if he's his main, especially if he's making a yeah. switch. And it's it's interesting because um it's like almost like oh, that's probably not what Oh, that was a miss input if I've ever seen one, for sure. Uh, good stuff to Michael, though. I felt like he tried to go for the forward air a little bit too early. I would have loved to have seen him get the panic option of Crudge, getting hit from two eggs. Sometimes Ike will tend to uh, panic, but Crudge definitely is still going to hold on to that. Oh, he missed the ledge. That's something we do see from Suarez to come up from above. He likes to go for those down Bs because he can eat, uh, snap the ledge. Suarez is a tricky Yoshi main. Yeah. One of the best Yoshi mains out there for a reason. Him and Raptor always team up, right? Yeah. It'll be like some of the best Yoshis are like uh, we also have Meme from Mexico, uh, really really great Yoshi. Dren from Hawaii, another great Yoshi. Some of the Yoshis mains they're they're great for a reason. But Michael looking to prove his worth here, putting Crutch at 118. Yeah, he, he said that this input Ooh. cost you so much, and it cost you the game. How did that connect? <laughs> that was quite Ooh. the read. Well, he so the only thing is the fact that Ike has uh, 